Hello YouTube, it is me, Death of Uber Pokes, and first, I mean, oh, I'm not even used to my name yet, uh, Garchomp Rage Quit, and first of all, this is one of the longest battles I've ever had, I sped it up like, oh my gosh, and yeah, because this match was like 39 minutes long, and then if you do see any blackouts, it's because I wasn't really looking at my screen, and uh, for, uh, for, unfortunately it does go into a little sleep mode, but you know, it it's kind of predictable of what happened, so yeah. Um, let's uh, already start this off. So um, he goes with the turtwig. I go with Machop, and yeah, he's it's a stall chop, stall stall wig, and so I'm just gonna switch out into my Vibrava, and he um does predict that, and he goes into a substitute, and um yeah. So right now I I'm just gonna go outrage. And I guess he predicts that, and he goes for another substitute, which is pretty smart of him. So, yeah. And, um, so I go for another Outrage, which doesn't really do anything. Because he's gonna go for another substitute. So, yeah, this is this part is just all a matter of who, who dies first. So, yeah, a stall war. And, because I do have Life Orb. And yeah, so um, yeah, he I get my confused, and he takes this as an opportunity to leech seed my uh, yeah, leech seed my Vibrava, and yeah, um, yeah, so since I think he's gonna not go for substitute again, he go I U turn, and yeah, I did it, and um, yeah, I uh get into my Rampura, but I guess he predicts my move, and he's, he went for a synthesis, and, um, he's basically almost up at full health, but, you know, so I substitute, because I know he's gonna leech seed, and I will be calm minding right about now, no, wait, hold on, oh crud, so I know he's gonna switch, he's to something which might pick take it out but I know since I was able to do that I um, was able to calm mind and successfully stay into my uh, sub and now I get to do my flamethrower and it doesn't quite take it out but um yeah well any sidekicks and he does take out my sub so yeah um but I do flamethrower again and he leaves it in for a death fodder and yeah so now he goes back, he goes into a Sparrow and he pursues, I guess he predicted a switch, but I didn't. And I flamethrower and I do take it out because of the plus one. I don't know, I think it was a little too much for it. So now he goes into a Cranny Dose. And um, yeah, so yeah, he Earthquake takes it out. So I should, Rampura or Shandera should have... Um, levitate because they're flowing in there. So yeah, I go into my my chop and mm, he goes into his turtle again. Uh, I close combat it. I think I really don't remember because this thing is kind of going too fast. But you know, uh, I close combat again. And but he switches into his. Uh, I forget that already. I mean, I forget the name of it. So I just switch into this thing, a uh, Kamatana. Komatana, I think, yeah, but he sleep powders it, so, um, right here it does black out for a bit because I was not monitoring my, um, my, uh, screen, so I'm very sorry about that, I will make sure that I will, uh, monitor my screen a lot more often, I'm, yeah, so, um, he, for this whole time it blacks out, it's basically, um, still asleep, so you wouldn't really need to worry about it, um, but yeah see here he comes back and he is still asleep so he does switch into his turt wig and he takes it as an opportunity to actually do everything and uh i forgot that sucker punch does only do things like yeah so um he gets his hp restored and yeah. so since i know what to do now i will night slash and apparently it does a lot after he's his sub fades and I am and he will leave it open like that so it's pretty awesome 
and there I do my night slash and it does a crud load well less than half but still yet I mean it's all right I'm as I said I am pretty rusty at the game so you know you gotta bear with me <laughs> sorry so um yeah um so he subs again and I was just gonna leave my Kamatana to a death fodder because leech seed is already there so I'm gonna so just go into a Pokemon that doesn't get leech seeded and I do go into my bag on a DD dance bag on um and yeah I thought it would be enough to take the uh, thing out but it doesn't so oh yeah I know it sucks but I do get off an outrage and I do take out the sub but I already know he might sub again so we might as yeah so um right here I no wait not yet so I outrage again and uh yeah it the sub fades he goes for another sub I think no no yeah he does <laughs> sorry I'm being so confused and um I get my confused and yeah so right here I do get hit with the confused and I die pretty bad sorry if you hear any background things So yeah, my bag on does die, and I'm going into my Vibrava, and I kind of already know it's I already lost because I lost my physical sweeper, and my Vibrava can't really do anything anymore. Even though it's a mixed Brava, it still can't do anything anymore because this Turtwig can actually stall to the max and win. So he does switch into his uh. Tyler, which is his, I forget again, and, um, I U-turned on it, and I go into my War Turtle, and, uh, it's a Sleep Talk one, <laughs> so, yeah, uh, Ice Beam, and I thought it was gonna actually do something to it, but then I forgot, it's not really a special sweeper, it's my wall, so he goes to sleep, but as long as I know it's a Sleep Talker, yeah, I'm good, I'm golden, but, I sleep talk and I get the ice beam off and again it doesn't really do physically anything or you know virtually anything because yeah it's you know as I said it's a wall not a sweeper and I you know sleep talk and I wish I'm not wish surf I'm getting I'm just tired all right I'm tired so now I giga drain. Now he giga drains, and it doesn't really do a lot, cause yeah, my war turtle's just a beast. And I and I thought, oh, oh there it blacks out again. But it, I do um switch out, I think. And yeah, so I forgot that rest or sleep talk does only go for at least three turns. So remember that. <laughs> and um now I giga he giga drains, and here I think I already um. Right here, I will be, like, running. I think I'll run away soon, but, you know, I do run away, because I know it's a good game. So, um, yeah, good game, Aaron the Blue. I hope to see you guys actually commenting on this thing. It's an NFE. He really likes it. I actually like his battles because he uses NFEs on OU pokes. So, check out his channel. It will be under the link. I mean, it'll be in the com um, my description. Check him out. Please sub him. He's an awesome guy. Um, yeah, and yeah, check out his channel. I mean, it's a good. It's a long match, so like, I think I did pretty well on it because I did pretty much hold off for a while. And plus, I ran away. That's how you know I kind of lost. So, and it's 39 minutes, so you might want to think about that if I went a little faster. I mean, a little longer if until someone actually lost. So, um, yeah, uh, check out, um, Aaron the Blue on his channel. Sub him, please sub him, and also sub me because I'm awesome like that. 
and it was an NFE. It was my first try of doing NFEs. I did Little Cup before, but not never an NFE. It came to me a little awkward, but you know, it was Aaron in the blue, and I couldn't just resist. I couldn't resist um saying uh yes to his request because it was gonna be my first battle for this account, and yeah. So sub him, sub me, rate rate this battle, rate. Um, I mean, comment this battle and please sub me. I will be getting off more battles that will be wins and stuff. So, um, please don't um sub, alright? So, yeah. Um, this is Garchomp Rage Quit signing off. Peace out.